Roblox Souls RNG Era 9 is finally happening and they just shared their biggest sneak peek yet. A brand new map which honestly looks insane. But in this video, I will be catching you up with every bit of information about the new Era 9 update coming, including two new auras, new gear, and a new biome. So buckle up, grab that popcorn, because we are so back. But don't forget, I'll also be giving away 10,000 Robux on the release of Era 9. So keep hitting that subscribe button like it's the roll button. Today is a good day. We have something very, very special today. There is a new map, but also it looks very, very good. And I mean, it looks crazy, bro. It is absolutely insane. You know what's even better? In this video, I am going to be going over the new map, the sneaks you may have missed out on, an update on the UI, and also some confirmed auras, potential devices, and even a potential biome. But we are cooking it all up this video. So just in case you have quit Souls RNG, don't worry, I got you. This is all the information you need about Era 9, and it is coming very, very soon. In fact, you know what? I did recently give away 50,000 Robux, but if it's not this weekend, I will double down and I'll do it again. But don't forget, every time there's an update, there's always 10k Robux. So you know what? You can hit that subscribe button because you're going to cook regardless. And I'm going to cook. Era 9 will be our era. And we are so back. But anyway, let's head over to the Discord and check out this new map because there's super hype. So today, XYZ at 8 p.m. Wait a second. Isn't that like 5 a.m. for him? Something like that. Anyway, bro's grinding and he has shared the new map. It's time to get hyped. So here we go. A new loading screen as well. Preparing. And wait a second. This logo looks kind of cool. Ooh, and it lifts up just like that. Okay, let's go. New icon. Wait a second. What's that say? Pause. Souls RNG. Eon 1. What does that mean? Title, head, context. Huh? What is that? Oh, wait. That was the update logs. And wait a second. Wait. This map looks huge. And it, what? Wait. Are they other players? Why is there two of them? Anyway. Ooh, a golden leaderboard. But what is going on here? This map is absolutely massive, bro. What the? So you can go over here. Oh, wait, this is the new obby. So you jump over on the boat. Ooh, you jump over here. Okay. Then you jump over to the top. All right, we're actually gaming right now. Let's go. This is pretty sick. Jump over to the top. Oh, okay. So the obby looks really easy. I'm guessing they've done that because of the macros. And wait a second, bro, she's flying. That is really cool though, I like it. And wait a second, that mountain looks crazy, bro. Oh my Lord, there's so much open space. I love that because I'm guessing with more auras, it's gonna become a bit of a mess. If you're getting auras over a billion, oh, wait a second. Let me pause. Riggs UGC shop. That is actually so much cleaner. Look, there's the little Stella. Hopefully that Stella is less pixelated than this one. Oi, why are you raining on me and Stella? Anyway, I want to see that big mountain. The big mountain in that video looks way better than this one here. So please go over to the mountain. Wait a second. I haven't even clicked roll. You know what? Whilst we try to cook up another rare aura in Souls RNG, it's the perfect time to check out today's sponsor, Eldorado. And you know what? El Dorado hooked me up with five 1,000 Robux codes, which will be placed on the screen randomly, just like this one, whilst I show you this marketplace. It's first come, first serve. But you can find pretty much any game on El Dorado, which is sold by verified users, and the website has 24-7 customer support, free account warranty, instant delivery, and secure transactions, so you can avoid those pesky scammers. But if you're still worried about not receiving your game on the marketplace, well, El Dorado offer a money back guarantee so if you don't receive your order you will be refunded. Having thousands of games at a discounted price sounds too good to be true so if you don't believe me well there is over 32,000 reviews with a 4.3 rating on Trustpilot so if your pocket money is running low or your parents say it's too expensive well check out El Dorado and you can get some juicy discounts. I even have a discount code which you can use which is on the screen now so why not just even browse El Eldorado and check them out. The link is in the description. Anyway, back to the video. All right, here we go. The house is still there. The house has moved. Is there any use to that? And wait a second. It's Jake's workshop. 
They've changed his sign as well. Anyway, so they added a bookshelf to the house. And come on, he's going over. He's going over to the mountain. Let's go. Wait, this is really cool. And the entrance to the cave is there as well. Okay, let's go. All right, anyway. Ooh, is this going to be like an obby as well? Is there going to be anything at the top? So you got to jump up here. Bro is climbing. Why does he have a sign and a cone on his head, by the way? But anyway, he is jumping all the way around. Look at this. Wait, hide and seek is going to go crazy on the new map. Holy. So bro is jumping up here. There's a nice little bench there. Ooh. Okay. And then you've got to go all the way around. This is a bit of a trek, bro. I'm not going to lie. There best be something up here. Hopefully they don't show it now and they save it for the update. Oh, wait. Wait, what is that? What is that? Is that like a water fountain? It's like a giant cup, bro. And anyway, look at the map. All in all, that looks really nice. And let's just pause it here for a second. So you've got the new UI as well. So the buttons are cleaner. The roll, quick roll, and auto roll are different. Oh yeah, if you look at it, that is the old UI. That is the new one. So it is very nice. Also, the text looks cleaner as well. I'm a big fan of that. I'm honestly glad that Souls RNG, after not updating for so long, they came back with a bang. But speaking about the UI, they did also share what the collection page looks like. So if we head over here, look at it. It actually looks quite nice. And wait a second. You can pause the music and you can also skip through the song. I'm a big fan of that. And if we head over here, you've got the ethereal, required conditions, any biome. Wait, I like that a lot. Got the little description here. All in all, this is way nicer. Good job. Good job, Souls RNG. I am so glad you actually cooked. They've finally done it. They've finally done something good. We take those. But anyway, they did share some pictures of the cave. I'm not going to lie, bro. It is so dark. I cannot see anything. But based on the map we saw, I'm pretty sure they're going to cook. Souls RNG have finally done something. And Souls RNG is about to get a whole lot better. We take those. I am so hyped. But also, let's check out the second screenshot. Boom. And there it is. So you can see there's like trees. I'm not going to lie. It's giving like a Minecraft vibe. It looks like a lot of space in the caves now. And you know what? We take those. There's actually something to to do that would be epic so if i head over to era 9 progress now you see that they've nearly done the auras there's new gears coming biome system and testing so there's a new biome confirmed i'm not gonna lie since i'm not a content creator anymore i have no idea what the new biome is there's new gear which would be absolutely goaded and wait a second map is in era 9.5 wait the map's not coming in era 9 huh oh my lord not like this bro not like this but anyway based on what is coming in era 9 there's auras and gears and biomes so we need to go check them out the first one that they did confirm in the rdc presentation was the atlas aura and i'm not gonna lie i love this cutscene so much I really hope they cook something like this for the actual cutscene because a lot of the times they change it. And you got to keep in mind, this is a 1 in 277 million. God damn, I love it. Very clean. I really want this aura, bro. I'm not going to lie. I have not been rolling much recently on Souls RNG. I'm just saving all my luck for era 9, baby. Let's go. I believe. I believe in the noodle look. We are so back. I am going to carry era 9. Like, bro is carrying the atlas. He is carrying the globe. And also, these are the ability and animations let's go so he fires out a compass and i guess you teleport to it i can't remember what do you do oh it's lit up and wait a second it's going it's flashing boom and you teleport across the map that is so good bro that is absolutely amazing we take those i really want this aura and i'm glad it is fully confirmed but the next aura we know is confirmed is matrix overdrive reimagined this is the second aura we know which is confirmed and look at it it looks absolutely epic bro this is why the new map needed to be so wide because look at the aura bro it's absolutely massive but doesn't that look like super hd HD. I love that. So clean, so crisp, and I cannot wait to see that in the new map, bro. Atlas and Matrix, we are gonna cook, bro. Just look at all the Celestials I have. Boom! I am so ready. I just need to craft these before Era 9. And I'm not gonna lie, I have a slight feeling that Era 9 is this weekend. I've taken a week off, but we are back. We are ready for Era 9. We are gonna cook. But also, I've not forgotten, we need to check out potential gears and potential biomes, because I have no idea what they're gonna be. So if I head over to Fee feature request wait a second what was that straight away heavenly device so here it is gauntlet for left hand effects after 50k rolls you get heavenly 
one status effect and a chance of one quarter to turn into a heavenly two. Roll save if you change to another device midway and the rolls remaining are displayed when you place mouse on top of the buff this gives, like on the weird chip on gravitational. Ooh, wait, this is really cool. Gives as well a passive 10% on roll speed cooldown and 75% luck additive to base luck. It would work still with another heavenly potion, but the buff would only be additive, meaning the buff from the device will be consumed first, then your heavenly one or heavenly two effects from the potions. With oblivion potion, it will ignore a heavenly one and two effect and it won't consume it in that role. So this is pretty cool. Essentially get a free heavenly one after 50k rolls. And you know what? I actually really like it. So let's have a look at what the formula is. What would you need to craft the heavenly device? And wait a second, this could tie in perfectly with a heavenly biome. Heavenly device, heavenly biome. Oh my Lord, a heaven fiend would go crazy. And that would kind of fit with the massive like gauntlet, not gauntlet, chalice. The chalice on the mountain. That would fit so good in heaven if that turned gold. But the crafting would be one celestial divine, five celestials, 50 comets, 750 quartz, 10,000 crystallized, 20,000 divinus, one jackpot gauntlet, three heavenly two potions. Wait a second. Using heavenly two potions for crafting would go crazy. That's actually genius. And then you've got the fan art of the effect. Wait a second. Broden images? Oh my lord. Bro has cooked an icon here, which actually looks good. The gauntlet, which is pink. I'm guessing that's because of the celestial divine. And also here, the original and his. Oh, wait. I love that. The mosaic theme. That is really clean. And then if we go here, bro, I'm not going to lie. I am no longer in school. So yeah, I don't know what the hell that means. I feel like algebra is one of those things you do at school and then you never actually do it in real life. A, X, okay, no, 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 no. We're not going back to that. But that was crazy. I'm just an idiot and I'm not going to lie. You guys probably know algebra. So you guys can make an understanding out of that. Basically, the look looks great. The looks look good. Air and I looks good. And I cannot wait to cook some more auras for you guys. But anyway, that is enough yapping. I will see you in Air and I. Next video will be in Air and I. And I cannot wait. We are so back. And don't forget, you can join us too if you hit that subscribe button. We're all cooking together.